Hello, this is Justin from EMR Shielding Solutions here to demonstrate the Latinx AF3500 EMF meter. So we have many questions from our clients regarding microwaves and how you can measure them. And we thought we'd make this video just to demonstrate our meter and how you can properly measure your microwaves at home. So to start with, we'll turn on the meter. The power button is on the side here, so you just hold that down. And there are three types of modes with this meter that you can measure. There's EF, which is electric fields, MF, which is magnetic fields, and RF, which is radio frequency. So microwaves emit two, two types of EMF, so that would be magnetic fields and RF uh, radio frequency. When the microwave is off and it's not heating anything, but still plugged into the electricity, it'll be emitting magnetic fields. When it's on and it's cooking, then that's when it's emitting microwaves, which are form a high frequency or radio frequency. So to start off with, we'll measure in the, the magnetic field. So to do that, we just hit the MF button and it'll switch modes. So right now, the magnetic field is measuring in milligauss, which you can see up here. With magnetic fields, you can either measure in two types of units. There's milligauss or microtesla. So right now we're getting a reading of about 3.3. Uh, milligauss. And if you get closer to the microwave, you can see that will go up. With magnetic fields, the farther away from it you are, the less reading you get. Magnetic fields generally don't transmit very far distances, unlike radio frequency, which is meant to transmit for, for farther distances, like miles even. Um, so to demonstrate that, we'll switch into RF mode. Now this meter can measure in multiple units for RF. Right now I'm measuring in millivolts per meter. If you want to change the unit, you just hit the menu button. Hit the light button to select RF unit. And then hit the hold button to enter that. And then you can cycle through the options by hitting the light button. And then once you're on the unit you want, you hit the enter button, and that will select the unit. So right now this is a low reading. It's around uh, 20, 20 millivolts, which is pretty low. But when we turn the meter on, you'll see that. Now it's much higher. So this unit will convert to volts per meter once it reaches over 1,000 millivolts. So right now, this is almost 10,000 millivolts at the highest value, which is extremely high. So our recommendation is when you start cooking your food in a microwave, it's just to keep back a safe distance. The farther away you are, the, the less radiation you'll receive. 